What's up guys? Well, I stopped by the local steel supply store today and I picked up some thick metal. This stuff is three inches wide by one inch thick. It's the thickest stuff they had and what I plan to do with this today is try to make an anvil. It is mild steel so I'm probably going to have to get a high carbon top or some tool steel that I can harden and put on top but for now I'm just going to get the main part of it done. I went ahead and cut all these pieces out with my angle grinder I got four pieces that are six inches long I got three pieces that are eight inches long one piece that is 14 inches long and what that basically looks like here show you guys. this is what I'm thinking anyway Right now it weighs a little over 50 pounds and it stands 8 inches tall and this longest piece here is 14. Now I just got to put it all together and make it work. Let's go ahead and get started. Cut the 45 on all the corners, basically just giving myself a place to fill with weld. And so now I can go ahead and fill every one of these cracks all the way around with weld and then grind them down and fill them in and grind them down and fill them in until it's perfect. Sadly I'll be using just a little Chicago Electric 90 amp flux wire welder. So it's not designed for this by any means, but I'm going to make sure, try to make it work anyway. But let's see what we can do. Got it all welded together. My welds aren't perfect, but they definitely will hold and they'll do the trick. I'm going to go ahead and take all these sharp corners down now and try to round it out and get ready for the next part. But these, this is all four of the six inch pieces welded together.
guys, well, my anvil is all done for the most part. Took quite a while, quite a bit of time grinding on it, shaped that horn and everything. And it is still mild steel, so I am going to get a high carbon top or some type of tool steel that I'm going to weld on here. Eventually, it'll be heat treated. But for now, it should do the trick. It is a pretty nice anvil. It weighs just under 50 pounds, which isn't too bad. And I think I'm going to go ahead and probably stake it to this log well, along with putting a big round thick chain around it too. Hopefully that will help. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Go ahead and be using it a lot in my next videos hopefully. Uh, thanks for watching and have a great night.